Hey guys. What's up? We're about to go do some diving here tonight. Mm -hmm. And um, I'm gonna take you along with us. All right, mm -hmm. see you in a few. Hey guys, we just got back from diving. Me and Mike went tonight. Um, we went to a few different stores. Uh, I wanted to give a quick little intro here because some of the videos have gotten cut off here and there because I accidentally shut the camera off. Is I'm still working with the new camera. But um, it was an accident because I thought I was pausing it. But um, you didn't miss anything because when I did turn it off, it was actually ended up happening in good spots. So, um, But at the end where it cuts out, um, we were digging for, he was finding cookie packs in the Staples dumpster. You'll see it when we get to that. Um, there was, I think there was one more box left in there, but it was covered in ants when he got in. And it cut off before that happened, so you didn't miss anything. All right, so let's get on with the video. Don't forget to give this video a thumbs up, like, comment, and subscribe. And I hope you enjoy this video. See you at the end. Bye. All right, so we're here at Kirkland's right now. Yep. See what's going on. Let me get the crate. Are you good? I'm good for right now. It almost looks like someone beat us here. A lot of bags ripped open. This is heavy. Huh? It's heavy? Almost full of broken glass. <gasps> wonder if there's anything back there. See that thing? How do you know? You can see it. No, there's just styrofoam. Someone was here and that's empty back there. They probably cleaned it out. You should see if you dig around in there. That's it. Yeah, someone cleaned this out good. You can tell somebody's been here because stuff's been ripped open. Dang it, man. Oh, well, there's another box. This is what happens when you come a little bit late. Yep. There's a little bit. Not always, but... Even 20 minutes late, you can miss it. Yeah. Well, we usually like to get here when they close, and... Yeah, well... Just lift it. Oh, there's another box. Oh, it's been gone through. Yeah. This has definitely been gone through, so... I think we missed out. I mean, sometimes you get lucky if you get someone who doesn't jump in and they don't, don't do go too full, far. Full dig. Yeah, because there's plenty of times we don't do full digs. And we probably forget stuff, but... Yeah. All right, well, moving on to the next one, I guess. Man, that thing's amazing. Okay, it's even worth Um, Because you got the gloves on. These gloves are going to be trash after this. I'll just wash them. Just rip it. Well, they doubled that bag. Alright, yeah, I'm going to, I'm counting on you to dig through a little bit. Literally. That's a cord they cut off your lamp. No, yeah, that's the wrong one. Anything that looks like they didn't ruin and they just soup the bottle. I wish I had gloves on. Can I brush? <laughs> I'm gonna cut the cord off that too. That's disgusting. Look how much liquid in the bottom of that. Wow. Are you paying attention to what I don't to even know what recording? some of that stuff is. Yeah. You're like facing it at the ground. No, I'm, I've got <laughs> it. Alright, that one's a no-go. I gotta not touch that stuff. <clears throat> Alright, put your other glove on. Okay. Here, you, Alright, where's the makeup you had? Will you open one of them? No, that's okay. I got it. I don't know what you're looking for. I don't. I'm not, don't date for makeup. Man, all them clippers. Look at this. Shoot, that could be washed. Will you open up that bag? Which one? The gray one. Alright, and that makeup you found earlier? Nice. Anything nice. that can be salvaged, I'm going to take. I don't dig for makeup. I can't tell what that is. If it's broke or opened. Oh, one of them combs. Nervous fart. Yeah. <laughs> is that you farting? Yeah. I thought I kept moving something in the peg. You're nasty. There's another one coming. Oh, <laughs> you're disgusting. 
I had spaghetti for dinner. I don't think I'm gonna find anything good in here, guys. It's for a real. Nervous part. Look, beautiful clippers. They broke them, and Whew. I have no interest in fixing them. I just don't get that. Wow. Some nice brushes, though. That's not nice. That's like a brush for like a horse. <laughs> you know nothing about brushes. All right, that's about it. We're gonna get out of here. My glove is ruined. All right, my I'm going to shut away. this uh, camera off for now, guys. we got to clean this up and get out of here. Mm. All right, we're at Spirit Halloween, hoping that maybe there's something in here this time. I don't have my gloves with me. Looks like a bunch of cardboard, but the other dumpster, the other broken. it's not broken. It's empty, but it doesn't open. It's weird. No, I don't have my gloves with me. They're sitting in the car, but most of this is cardboard and there's not like weird stuff in here. Like gross stuff. I'm guessing this might be all just cardboard. We're probably gonna find the most in here right after they like day after Halloween. Oh, probably. People try to return stuff and stuff that's broken. The kids putting up. Holy crap, that's broke. <laughs> Anything down there you wanna dig while I hold this? Well, whatever area you can. Holy plastic! Plastic and plastic. Nothing but plastic in it. This. Who? Oh, what's that over there? Just plastic. This was be cardboard boxes only. It doesn't say that, so I'm not sure. Honestly, if they couldn't get in that other trash can, maybe they put it in one down there. All right, so let's put this stuff away, and we'll go check the Dollar Tree. Ooh. You're gonna need the gloves for the Dollar Tree, so why don't you just move the car over there? Oh. No, I don't want to smell it. I smelled it enough at the last one. All right. The scared part. You drive the car over here, and I'll walk up. Okay. Drive. There's something in the road. Be careful. Oh, well, this one's really full. Like, really full. I still don't know what that place is. You know what? I need a glove. Wanna hand me a glove? No. Turn it off and get out. All right. Oh, come on. I can't get my fingers in here. So freaking cool. This is gonna be hard to look through. Well, you're not really pointing the camera at anything, is Oh, am I? I'm not? No. Sorry, guys. Well, oh, I got my glove on the wrong me. one. Cardboard, cardboard. Try the other side. Wanna check this side? I'll look Hold back it. here real quick. I see cardboard. I think get a lot of stocking recently. I smell stuff, that's for sure. Gross. Yeah. Ooh. It wasn't me this time. I know, it smells really sour and foul. Yeah, it's the uh, pork rind box. Stinky. I think it's more than just pork rinds. Pork rinds. <laughs> All right, on to the next one. All right, we are at Staples. Let's see what's happening over here. Hopefully something's happening. Right away, I can't tell if anyone's been here or not. What do you mean, where's the grabber? Maybe in the trunk? Oh, this is 
heavy. Honestly, this might be one of the times you have to get in here and look around. There could potentially be some stuff in here. Did you bring the crate? No? I'll go get the crate. You're supposed to turn the car off. I'm wasting battery. There could be anything in here, dude. And that display is wicked heavy. I couldn't move it. It doesn't look like anybody's been in this one. Yeah, that bag ripped open, this bag ripped no, it ain't. Open. It's thrown in here. Remember we found software in here. Oh, dang. Man, you lifted that thing like it was nothing. There's those boxes down there. All those. Oh yeah, just take it right out if you have to. There could be anything in here. Remember that night I told you we pulled out the bag of software? Big box, wasn't it? No, it was a big bag. It was just like one of those bags and it was full of software. that bag with all the colorful stuff on it. Oreos? Yeah, just go for it. Trash. it. Yeah, I know, but they might put other stuff in there. I'm just trying hopeful, to be hopeful. <laughs> right it's still greasy, huh? Yeah. I shouldn't have done the other one. <laughs> Come on. I know, that beauty supply place. Ruined our grabber. Kind of sucked. They bend it and everything. Look at this. Put it in the hole and just start twisting. Now twist. Yeah, just keep going. Now yank. Oh, it's heavy? No, it's just stuck. But you go grab, told me to grab the one at the bottom. Oh, uh, well, maybe we'll have to move stuff from that. But we can actually check it. I don't think those are empty. Mm -hmm. Why don't you just get in, like right here? You see all that hard plastic I gotta step into? It's not hard plastic. It's plastic, I'm like. my legs. It's not hard plastic. Look at this, guys. Score. Uh, let's see. Oh, that was good. <laughs> I was trying to, like. <laughs> Here, fix the box before I ruin it. Okay. Here, guys, check that out. And it's full. Not bad. And I've seen more than one, so he definitely found a score here. Here's the second one. Not bad, not bad. This is the rest of the bag. I'll I'm going to shut off the camera for a minute, guys, and see if we decide if he wants to get in or not. I'll be right back. All right, guys, here is our haul for tonight. Let's start with the Staples haul. And Staples, we there was, um, I think you guys saw in the dumpster, there was three boxes of these, but one of them was covered in ants. I kind of briefly discussed it at the beginning of this video, but they were fire ants, and we weren't messing with that because they hurt so bad, and it's just for days. So that was a pretty good score for these two great donations. And then at the beauty supply place we got into for the very first time, this is actually, how much money did we add it up? Like after tax, like $120 or something. Yeah, with, well it might be more than that. With tax it'd probably be, what was it before tax? Like $117. Like, we, were, we were looking at yeah, online. This right? stuff was $117 um, before tax that it came to. The light is missing, the. well it, they cut the cord but it'd be easy to replace. 
and um, the other things are little odds and ends and it would have came to $117 retail mm -hmm. before tax. All brand new, beautiful condition. We cleaned them off. They were souped with like um, bleach, hair dye. bleach hair dye, not like bleach cleaner. Hair dyes, like Michelle said, nail polishes. It was crazy. These ones didn't have nail polishes on but them. It so good. yes, a couple of great brushes, some combs, picks, uh, like a bronzer. Um, it has to be repressed, but this is brand new, unopened. It's like a um. What's the brand here? Bitsy. Bitsy Bronze Blush Duo. You guys see that? Online it had like the top part was the bronzer and the bottom part was the blush, but this one looks like it yeah. got broken mixed together. Sugar and spice. It's still in the packaging. It needs to be opened and then repressed. Um then we got these bring the light down here. We got these beautiful combs. I mean these things are nice. Um their ion got this comb oh and we got this this is pretty cool it's called Ardell touch of color anyway and it's got like these bristles on the tops here and um here I want to make sure you could see that anyway like if you need a touch of color in your hair or maybe even your eyebrows maybe you've got grays showing or maybe you dyed your hair and your roots are showing this is what this is for. That is freaking awesome. And of course, the mirror, guys. This mirror is awesome. I'm not even going to pick it up. But it's got eight times magnification. And the other side has got, um, I think, regular. one time. Yeah, and it has, you know, this is where the plug was removed or, you know, cut off. Got an extra outlet on there. So peel off the bottom, head to Lowe's and get one. You guys don't see me grab a lot of stuff that needs plugs out of the dumpster, even if it's brand new, because I'm only going to grab it if it's something I want. I am not in the business of collecting and reselling stuff. I do not have the room for it, and I do not want my house cluttered with stuff that needs to be fixed and stuff to sell. I do not have the room for it. So when it comes to things like this, I take what I think I would really truly want. When it comes to the food, I take whatever and as much as I can fit into our car because as soon as I bring it home, I clean it, we bag it up, and then we can donate it and it gets out of our house. So, yeah. But anyway, I hope you guys enjoyed this haul. I know it's not a lot, but it was an interesting night. Don't forget to give this video a like, comment, and subscribe. Alright guys, bye!